everyone, today I'm going to show you how the new job system works in Bloxburg and how you can make money fast with the new system. So let's get right into it. Bloxburg's most recent update changed their job system. Every job pays exactly the same now. To accomplish this, Bloxburg made the high paying jobs pay lower and the low paying jobs pay higher causing a lot of controversy in the community because of the decreased pay. Bloxburg also made it easier to gain work experience at lower levels compared to before, so new players won't have to work as long or as hard as old players did to level up. Basically, it doesn't matter what job you do anymore, you should make the same amount of money at all jobs. Your pay at any job depends on two things, your efficiency and your total work experience. Promotion levels do not affect your pay at all anymore, they only show your progress at a specific job and offer awards. So you can ignore promotion levels entirely now. Your efficiency shows while you're working, you need to be doing tasks often and have all of your moods high to be at 100% efficiency. This means you will make the most amount of money from that job. Your total work experience shows at the top of your jobs here and on the shift you're doing. It has a maximum level of 100. The higher your level is, the more money you will make from all jobs. You can level up your total work experience by working at any job in the game, so it's super easy to level up. It also takes a few minutes to actually get your earnings up now. For example, when you work at pizza delivery, you usually get a really low amount for your first pizza. Some people say they are getting like $20 a pizza, but this isn't true. After a few minutes, how much you earn will significantly increase from this, and you should be making much more money. You should never be making only $20 per pizza for more than a minute or two. In my opinion, while the new efficiency system and leveling up easier is nice, this is a really bad update since it sacrifices older players' pay and it just isn't necessary to do that. However, it looks like this is going to remain in the game unfortunately. So while you can't make as much as you used to, you can still make money fast with this update. So let's get into the tips and tricks. The first tip is to choose a job that you enjoy the most. Since you will make the same at any job, you don't have to worry about getting paid less for not working pizza delivery or Bloxburger. Try out the jobs you haven't worked at yet and choose the one you enjoy the most. The second tip is to listen to music instead of watching something while you're working. Staying entertained while you work helps you work longer and make more money. Many people watch YouTube or a show while they work, but this may not be the best option anymore. Most of the jobs require more focus now, such as Bloxburger with so many tasks and pizza delivery since the moped is faster, so you have to focus more to control it. Listening to music allows you to focus on your job more while also providing you entertainment while you're working. The third tip is when and how to boost your moods. You should only boost your moods once your efficiency decreases since that is going to lower your pay. This is typically around every 10-15 to 15 minutes. You can use block bucks to boost your mood, but it's actually better to use a mood station if you can. If you have any block buck items like a jacuzzi, TV, etc, you should use those for your mood station since they are much faster than regular items and keep your moods higher for longer. The next tip is to focus on leveling up your work experience. Promotion levels are basically irrelevant now except for their awards. Work experience determines how much you make and is what you should focus on. I'd recommend setting goals for this level and maybe trying to level up 1-3 to three times every day you work. Leveling up work experience should be easier at lower levels now with a new update, so take advantage of this and level up as much as you can. This will add up over time and you will make a lot more money once your experience is higher. Additionally, you get money and sometimes even block books as an award every time you level up, which can help you stay motivated. The more you level up your work experience, you will also level up more at the job you're working and potentially get money awards from that individual job as well. The next tip is to save your money. The more money you already have by saving it, the less you will need to work. To save money, I'd advise you to plan your builds before you build them so you don't waste a lot on deleting things. Additionally, when building, use undo instead of delete always. Undo gives you 100% of your money back, while delete only gives you around 70. Finally, just don't spend money on things you won't use often. It may sound obvious, but this will save you so much money over time. Next is to consider buying excellent employee. Despite what some people say, excellent employee does still work with a new update and it still increases your earnings. As you can see on this paycheck, I made a lot more than I otherwise would have because of excellent employee, even with a decreased pay. Next is to not buy Bloxburg cash. 
This is a mistake you should never make. It may be tempting to buy Bloxburg cash instead of working, but this is a waste of Robux or real money if you choose to buy a subscription. Eventually, you will run out and you'll have to buy even more if you still don't want to work. If you just work instead, you will get the same amount of money you can buy in a relatively short amount of time and without spending any Robux. It's so much better to use jobs or make money without working than to buy money, which leads into my next tip. The last tip is to make money without working. Before this update, the money you can make without working was usually a lot less than what working gave you, but now that they decrease the pay, this difference is much less. You might even be able to make more money without working than with working because of how badly Bloxburg decreased the pay. Here are some effective ways to make money without using jobs. One, build houses for people. Some people will pay you to build a house for them and also pay for the cost of the house. This is always more fun than working. Two, have a business like a cafe, restaurant, or Uber driver business. Some people have commented that they've gotten thousands of dollars from people tipping them. Of course, this isn't guaranteed, but it definitely can happen. Considering you also make money from businesses without tips at all, it's worth trying a business. 3. Participate in seasonal events Some events, like the elf hunt, give you money for participating. The events are usually easy to do, and you can follow tutorials. When we get updates, check for any event you can do where you can make some money. 4. Sell inventory items If you have trophies, plaques, or build mode items in your inventory that you don't want, you can sell them and get some extra money from something that you wouldn't have used anyway. And 5. Get your daily logins Logging in every day gives you a little bit of money and literally takes a minute to do. This money adds up over time as you can see on the screen. You can also get trophies from login streaks and visits that you can sell for even more money. Anyway, that is going to be all for this video. Hopefully you found this helpful. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.